I just want to say something about the latest situation in Ukraine, because I know that everybody is deeply concerned about the, uh, the barbarism that we've seen and the new focus of that barbarism by Vladimir Putin in the Donbass region, particularly his brutal offensive against Mariupol, uh, which is why yesterday I announced we'd be sending more artillery and doing everything possible to help the people of Ukraine defend themselves uh, in those areas. And at the same time, the extraordinary fortitude and the success of President Zelensky and the Ukrainian people in resisting Russian forces in Kyiv means that I can announce today that we will very shortly, uh, next week, uh, reopen our embassy in Ukraine's capital city. Putin has a, a, a huge army. Uh, he has a, a very difficult political position because he's made a catastrophic blunder. Uh, he has the, the only option he now has really is to continue to try to use his, uh, his appalling grinding approach, driven, led by, uh, by artillery, uh, trying to grind the, the Ukrainians down. And he's very close to securing a land bridge in, uh, in Mariupol now. Uh, you know, the, the, the situation is, is, I'm afraid, unpredictable at this stage. We